Before we can get back to the bathroom, there are some things that we've got to get done. The first thing that we have to do is we have to spray the yard. There is no getting around it. It is getting close. It's getting that time of year. So we have to do some spraying. All right. So just in case, don't necessarily do it the way I do it. And the reason why I'm telling you that is because I'm not wearing long pants. I'm not wearing wet boots. I'm not wearing gloves. I am wearing glasses. But I don't care because I've done this for a long enough time that it's already in me. I might as well just keep going now. And you never know. This might be the cure for COVID. So what I'm going to be doing is using some high yield two, uh, 2,4-D spray on the yard. Um, I know. So what I'm going to be doing is using some high yield two, uh, 2,4-D spray on the yard. Um, I know a lot of you out there are probably big on the entire idea of natural, organic, yada, yada, yada. I get it. So with that said, I am going to get started on getting this done. That way I can move on. We can get back to the bathroom, get this thing wrapped up. Because we are that close from wrapping that bathroom up. But this has to get done because of the time of year it is. And also the weeds are starting to take over that I can see in the yard and it's starting to drive me nuts just to give you an idea of what I'm dealing with here I have a neighborhood full of different people who care about different things which is not a big deal everybody's entitled to that but when you're trying to keep your yard as nice as possible it makes it really difficult to do that let's go ahead and get this done again I'm using 24d do not do this at home. If you wake up with a hangover tomorrow, will you still recall all my tales of sorrow? And who knows if I'll still be here to tell you I'm sorry? And who will assume the task? So that's it for the front yard. I will not record the back. I'll save you that. You kind of get the picture of what I'm doing. So uh, give me just a few minutes and I'll be back with you. All right, everybody. So we're back in here in the bathroom. We're almost wrapped up on this little project. I got my uh, front yard, my backyard, all my edgings all sprayed this morning. So the yard work is out of the way for today. I might find some more, but that's for something completely different. Uh, back in here, I got to get this place cleaned up before I can get started on anything because it is a mess still. I want to get underneath the cabinet cleaned. Under, excuse me. I want to get underneath the vanity clean. I want to get all the stuff out so I can see what I got going on. Uh, I did go buy a toilet paper dispenser for the wall. Still kind of not sure if I like it or not. So we're going to open up, put it on there, see how I like it. Um, I'm trying to match it to the faucet and stuff because I think that's always the best thing to do. So let's get started on getting this cleaned up. Let's see what that looks like out of the package on the wall. Um, I got some a uh, little bit better paint than the ceiling paint that I have. 
Also, I'm going to take the time after I clean up and put paper down and repaint the trim around the door. I need to repaint around the wall around the door trim, the casing and stuff, because I was sloppy and that's what happens when you're sloppy. So, um, and I think that's pretty much it for what I have to do in here. I think that's really it. I mean, I have the window casing and stuff, as you can see right around here that I want to do. Um, I might do that after I do the mirror. Yes, I'm going back to the mirror again. Um, I'm going to make the mirror a separate video in total. Um, or I might throw it in here. I don't know. We'll see what happens. Um, we'll see how far we get with everything. So let's jump in here and get this place uh, 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 dozed out and uh, cleaned up a little bit. Maybe it'll look a lot better in the video and get a beauty shot of this place a little bit. So. Uh, let's jump in. Sitting here in the sounds of a studio 
$29 Dirt Devil vacuum that I needed in a pinch. That thing is worth $49. <laughs> I'll tell you what, that thing sucks up carpet. And it's old, it's beat up, it's sucked up, uh, I don't know, it's sucked up uh, drywall, dirt, dust, whatever you want to call it. It sucked up everything. That is the best vacuum I've ever had. I'll probably never find another one like it. But that's my shop vac, my house vac, everything in one. So kudos to Dirt Devil. Okay, so I've got a caulk down the line on both sides. And I'm going to try something based on what I saw. Part of it doesn't make sense. Part of it makes sense. But basically, instead of caulking and sticking your finger or water on it or uh, a sponge, they're using either water or they're using some kind of like Windex or something like that. I don't know. Anyway, the ones that I've seen is that they've squirted it on. <laughs> Choo, 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 and then caulked it, but that doesn't make sense to me because you're wet underneath. So how does it grip? So I'm going to try a different route and, and I'm just going to see if it works. I'm just testing it. I mean, what's the worst that can happen? I have to do this over? That's fine. So basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and caulk it and then I'm going to spray and then I'm going to wipe it off with my finger to see if it actually works or not. And this is paintable caulking. Just in case you were wondering. And I shouldn't have to because it's a pretty nice bead except for the top. The rest of it looks like garbage. All right, so that little bead right there looks like garbage, but I think I got the rest of it looking nice, but I'm going to go ahead and do the spray test here just to kind of get the idea of what exactly they're doing. So, oh. Damn, that's pretty slick, really. It's a little messy at the bottom end of it, but. It does clean it up quite a bit and a lot faster. Leaves a hell of a lot less mess on your hands. I mean, that was previous, so that doesn't really count. So, that's not bad. I mean, I don't understand the idea of spraying it previous to it. So, that part doesn't really make a whole lot of sense to me, but I get the rest of it. Kind of makes sense. So, I've already done this side because I, I buy the way I usually do it, which is put it on and then I have a, a wet rag or a sponge and I, I use a sponge and I kind of wipe it down that way it cleans out the mess but that that's a whole lot cleaner and that's a lot niftier than the other way so I think that I'll do the other side that way too so just to kind of show you I mean it looks exactly the way I put it on and everything so but uh I guess I get to clean my walls and everything at the same time, so what the heck. All right, gang, door is on, it's painted, hinges, handle, countertop, vanity top's done, the vanity top's done, the vanity's done, toilet's in. I've got this part caulked this morning. I caulked around the edges right here. I got the edge down here caulked as well i look for any more issues that i might have it looks like everything's solid we are close to being done i'm gonna cut this out and i'm actually gonna video it i didn't figure you guys wanted to watch me caulk it didn't really make much sense to it i've got a little paint trim work to do around the casing
and I've got a couple touch-up spots right in here on the door. Uh, it kind of dried right in here, a little bit weird, so that's what I have left in this part of it besides the mirror. Again, for the 100th time, I've got to get the mirror done. <laughs> uh, but uh, this thing is basically wrapped up as soon as I get those little touch-up spots done in that mirror. Um, I actually have some outside work I have to get done first because it needs to get done. That way I can get this stuff done, get it in the back, because um, a lot of times in the middle of the day it just doesn't take care of it to uh, get everything done you need done. go. Perfect. Yeah, we're good. I like it. So uh, I'm happy to get the rest of it all nice and cleaned up and she's done and we can move on to the next thing. Um, not sure what the next thing is just yet, but I have some plans for that. So um, obviously the shower door is not on there. I still haven't picked one out. Uh, I gotta get on that, uh, but the next project's gonna cost me a little bit more money, so I'd much rather spend the money on that than the shower door for right now, because that can get a curtain on it for the moment and uh, kind of go from there. So, uh, with that said, that's all I got. Um, I really have a couple other projects outside that I gotta get started on and kind of go from there, um, but uh, yeah. Uh, I really appreciate y'all watching. Uh, always means a lot to me when you do that. So, you know, um, take time out of your day to do that when I post videos and uh, watch them. Uh, it means a lot. Um, don't forget to hit the like button on your way out. And as always, if you want to subscribe, subscribe. If you don't, you don't. It's nothing major. If you don't, I would appreciate it. But, you know, you guys have to make that decision. So, you keep watching. I'll keep posting. Have a good day.